I'm here with the Dollar Tree haul. This is my first time and I've been watching Dollar Tree hauls for like crazy and I'm like, I gotta do that. I think I can do this, so I'm gonna try. I went to the Dollar Tree and I spent over $100. Some of the stuff is for me, some is for my mom, some is for my child. So let me just start off and show you what I got. All right, I got white bread. Just a loaf of white bread, my mother wanted this. This is in random order. I got some Mr. Brownie Blondie Brownies. I think these will be good. Heat it up with chocolate syrup and vanilla ice cream. I got some coffee, original flavor. These fit in the Keurig. My sister gave me a pack of these for Mother's Day and they fit in the Keurig um, thing. They're individually wrapped, which is really cool. So yeah, and there's four in here, four individually wrapped. I got another flavor and I don't know exactly where it is yet, but we'll come across it later. Then I got some face masks. I see everybody hauling these. And if you look on Spa Life on their website, these, I think, this is a six pack. This might've been $10. The other ones, the little eggs I got last time that you put on your face, those retail for $25 on their website. But these, I think are $9.99. I'm not sure, I'll have to look it up again, but, but all these are very expensive to be at the dollar store. And I got three packs of these. They're in here somewhere, somewhere. I got um, this mask. Me and my daughter just want to have a spa day once in a while. You know, with this quarantine, you really can't do anything. So spa days. Um, I got some of these vanilla wafers for my mother. She likes these things. They're pretty good, actually. The, the ones with the chocolate inside are even better. But I didn't see those. I only saw vanilla. Um, I got a lady at my mother's place where she lives in her senior community. Wanted licorice, so I found some black licorice. These are soft. These are the original kind. I'm not sure. And then I got me a bag because I love black licorice too. Oh, here's the other spa life. Oh, and then we got some of these um, little smelly things to put in your closets and stuff. Just to have, just to make it smell nice in the house, you know, since you're stuck in here all day. Um, my daughter loves Monster. And I saw this Monster coffee and I'm like, ooh, she'll probably like this a lot. And then a lady at my mother's place also wanted some rollers. So these are my mother's favorite kind. They stick in your hair. You don't need a bobby pin or anything. You have to have short hair, but it sticks right in your hair and it works. Oh, and then some Dr. Pepper licorice. This is my daughter picked up. Dr. Pepper licorice. And then I saw people hauling these. Now and later. Um, candies and it looked good so I was like I gotta try this I don't know how it tastes but I'm pretty sure it's good uh, I got a book for one of the old people at my mother's place to do, have something to do it's a it's a color by numbers they're really tiny I hope I hope I hope they can see these little tiny numbers in there I don't know I saw everybody hauling these and I wanted one I wanted one of these to sit in my backyard and to drink and hopefully the bugs won't go in the straw. I was hoping. But it looked like fun. It looked like summer. So I wanted this. Oh, and then I found this watermelon body oil. While I'm outside with my drink, I can have my watermelon drink and my watermelon body oil to tan with. Well, not to tan with, but you know, to make it feel summery. I shouldn't be in the sun. And then my mother wanted some compression socks. But I found some diabetic socks at the dollar store, so... Every time I order her compression socks online, they're always the wrong ones. And she yells at me every time. And we have to return them every time. So let's see how these are. If these work, I'm going to go to the dollar store and buy all of them. Then I saw somebody hauling these. Um, there's a bacon cheddar potato skins. My daughter loves Lay's. Well, she loves Pringles. So I'm thinking she'll love Lay's because somebody else who hauled these said Pringles and Lay's taste the same. So she'll love these too. Then I found some pomegranate peel-off face mask. My daughter loves to do face masks. So I saw this and I said, oh, spa day, spa day. Then I saw somebody hauling these, I think it was Thrifty, Thrifty Tiffany, hauling these little tiny floating shelves. And I said, oh, those are cute. I only found one in my dollar store, just one. But I'm going to try it out. I'm going to see. I have all kinds of wall space. I could put it up there. I could, I, yeah. To burn candles high because I have cats and can't burn candles low. Then, oh, here's another one of these. 
another flavor. And I saw this pink flamingo and I just had to buy it because I thought it was hilarious for my yard. It has the little leg sticks here for my backyard, not in the front backyard. Then my daughter loves all these little wood things. So we got some little wood things. This, for some reason, looks so much bigger on TV. This is not that big. This is actually not that big. Look how little it is. But when you go like this, it looks huge. But when you go like this, it's it's small. It's like for maybe jewelry or something small. Nothing, nail polishes. I don't know. Not, you can't stick very much in here. It's small. But on here, it looks huge. I don't know. And then a little tiny, like, jewelry box to put stuff in. She could paint it or do something with it. And I found these. I thought these were so cute. I have another pack somewhere with something else on them, but I don't know where it is. But I saw these stickers and I thought they were so cute. I love collecting bottles and jars and I just thought they were cute. It's cute to decorate something with. Maybe make a picture or crafty something. I don't know. And we have a fairy garden in our backyard. So we got some more little things to go in our fairy garden. This one has a little owl and... I have a thing for owls, so there you go. Then I got me a beauty blender because I don't have one of these. I got a uh, Crafters Corners glue. Um, it says glue and residue eraser. Hopefully it works. I had some residue in my backyard on my thing that I want to try to get off. I had a sticker and I can't get it off and hopefully this works. Okay, my mother wanted some nail files. Just plain old nail files. And then I got some of these popcorn things. I showed you this already, didn't I? Yes. No, maybe. I don't know. No. I got two of these. One for me, one for my mother. I'm thinking she can like these. She's older. She doesn't really have very many teeth or things. And maybe she can eat these. And then she wanted a mail basket for outside of her door. Because they deliver the mail to their door in the, in the senior citizen community. And she lives on the fourth floor. So she wanted something like this put by her door for her mail. A little basket. Then I found some mixed fruit and jelly for my mother. These guys are so good. These are so good. They taste just like blueberries. Blueberry muffins. I mean, my sister showed them to me because she goes to the Dollar Tree a lot too. And I was like, she let me try them. And I said, when I find those at the store, I'm buying, I'm buying them. So I bought me two because these are so good. Like they have it tastes like a blueberry muffin, literally. It's so good. Okay. And then I see everybody hauling these big old jars of these um, mild banana pepper rings. These are, this is pretty big. For some reason, when you see it on TV, it looks kind of hollow and not very full, but it is pretty full. When I saw it on TV, I was like, that doesn't look very full, but it is. It looks, it's pretty full. I don't know what I'm going to do with this yet. Maybe put it in some salad or something. But there you go. Then I needed some dressing. It's not the, I don't know, I've never tried this dressing, but I needed some ranch dressing and I wasn't going to another store, so that's what I got. And then these cloth, these are by Clean Life, multi-purpose cleaning cloths. I really like these. I really, really do. You can reuse them or reuse them, reuse them, let them dry. I clean my stove with this. I love them. They, they're, they're good. Then my mother needed some hairspray. Old school 80s white rain hairspray. My mother also needed some, uh, what is this called? Fabric softener. And so I got her two different kinds. These are 11 and 10 and 11 loads. Oop, that was Phoebe. <laughs> These are 10 and 11 loads. Um, they're nice and small so she can take them with her to her little laundry room and stuff. They're not those big things where she can't handle them. So there you go. And then, oh, here's the other coffee. This is the breakfast flavor. Remember, they're individually bagged and they fit in the Keurig coffee makers. So they're pretty good. Uh, I needed some of these just in case, you know, I had a fire alarm beeping. I haven't found out which one it is yet, but there's some, there's a fire alarm beeping somewhere in this house, but only at night when you're sleeping. During the day, you can't hear it, but at night when you're sleeping, it beeps. And then when you look for it, it stops beeping, like it knows you're looking for it. We needed some of these to change the battery. When, when we figure out which one it is, it's like the funny episode in the King of Queens when they're running around their house trying to find that damn fire. Yeah, it's exactly like that, exactly. 
And then I have a cat in my bag. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> okay. Then I got oh, more face masks for spa day. This is um grapefruit. And this is also Freeman. Then I got some sponges to wash dishes. You know, basic sponges to wash dishes. Got to change these like every week, week and a half, whatever. We need some new ones. Then I saw somebody hauling this and this looked like fun. Flexible, um, it's flexible like rope for your garden, like to bring up your tomato plants or whatever. And I garden, I have a garden in my backyard every year. I get zucchinis that are this big. So I said, hmm, I might be able to use this on some stuff. I might be able to use it just to have it, just in case. Then my mother wanted some nail files. So more nail files, I got her the metal ones and I got her the cardboard ones. My daughter went crazy on these. I think she got like, I don't know, a lot. I think there's more somewhere else. I think she got five of these somewhere. These are very, very good. You can eat the whole pack at one time. You're not supposed to, it says you should, it says you should eat at least 10 pieces. And there's about two and a half serving sizes in here. So there's probably 25 pieces, but you can eat these in one sitting and they're great. They're just, they're great. I don't know, my cats are playing back there. Don't mind them. These are great. Then I bought some, yep. <laughs> I bought some dial soap, antibacterial dial soap to take a shower every day. You know, antibacterial, especially for right now with this whole world crisis we got going on here. So this this one smells pretty good, but yes, I, I would suggest every day when you shower to use antibacterial soap, at least for now. Then I saw this, I saw people hauling this and I said, oh, I want to try this. I don't know what it smells like. It's power stick body spray for her. But I, and if anything, I could stick it in my car and use it as a car freshener. But really, I shouldn't put this kind of can in my car if it gets hot. No, maybe not. Maybe not in my car. I don't know. But anyways, it looked like fun. I really don't smell anything. It says floral, but I really don't smell anything right now. But there you go. Then I saw this, this looked very interesting. I never saw it before, but a shaving cream, a pump, a shaving cream pump, and it's by Personal Care. It looked, it looked like something interesting. It's pomegranate raspberry flavor. I said, oh, I wanna try that. So, and it's cruelty free and it's made in Turkey. And it looked like something I wanna try. So I'll shave my legs one day, you know, when I go suntan in the backyard with my watermelon accessories. Then I saw somebody making something with these asparagus. Um, she made a quiche. I think it was Thrifty Divas. She made a quiche and she used these asparagus and she liked these better than the ones in the can. So I saw them and I said, oh, I'm gonna pick them up because I like asparagus and I never made a quiche, but maybe I will, who knows. Then my daughter wanted this. Uh, Lucky Charms. Ah, uh, marshmallow treat bar. She went with me to the store, so. She bought a lot of treats. Then I saw this cute little Care Bear and it took me back to my childhood. Look at that, look at him, oh, it's so cute. This one is the Love A Lot Bear. I really want a grumpy bear, but I didn't see him. So I got Love A Lot and I'm gonna stick it in my car. I like to stick little figurines in my dashboard. I have a little frog there. I've had it there for 11 years since my niece was born. It was my sister's, her sister's focal point when she was in labor and I he still sits in my car till today. So I saw this one, I said, you're gonna join Froggy in my car. Then I needed this basket to organize all of my treats. And this, I before I went to the store, I, I measured my cabinet with my arm. I said, my cabinet is as long as my arm. See, as long as my arm. And when I, see, as long as my arm. So when I went to the store, that's how I measured the size of the basket I needed because you're not you don't have a measuring tape and you can't figure it out. So I said, oh, my arm size good. This will fit in my cabinet. There you go. Just needed, just randomly needed one of those. Then my daughter also got herself a brownie. She used to eat these like crazy when she was a kid. Like crazy. Brown. Pretty good. Then I got some, uh, oh, I got a good find. I got to show you. Not this. This is just raviolis in a can. Nothing special. They're usually a dollar on sale at regular grocery stores, but we're not going to another store. We're only going to the dollar store, so we got some raviolis in a can. But, guys, I found pork and beans. This is 
is a one pound, 3.75 ounce can of pork and beans. This is the big can of pork. Look, normal size, big can. The big can of pork and beans. We love these things. Hot dogs with beans and fried potatoes, best. We grew up on that when we were kids. I made that for my daughter. My sister made that for my nieces and they said that was orphan food, but that's another story. So we got that, got that. Oh, I found these Velastic Snackums pickles. They're like little pickle chips, little like pickle half chips. I don't know. My daughter loves pickles and they go like, pickles go crazy in this house, pickles. My mother wanted something to decorate her door in the senior building. So my daughter found her a sunshine to decorate her door in the senior building. He's very cute. Hopefully he'll bring sunshine to the seniors who are trapped in there and can't leave. <laughs> then we saw some salon, oh man, no, it's not open. Some salon selectives, coconut and shea butter for my daughter's hair. She has curly hair and sometimes she needs to tame it. Hopefully this will help her tame her hair. I hope. And then, my kitchen is this color. And I saw this and normally when you buy towels at the dollar store, it has that feel where when you touch it, it feels ugh, and your hands get stuck on the, this one feels nice. This one doesn't have that feel because the one I have now has that feel and oh, I don't like it. This one is a, a nice towel. It's not a, I know you guys know what I'm talking about when you touch the towels. This is a good one. And it's cute and it's the same color as my kitchen. And here's the other back of those. So, oh, and then I saw somebody with this. Epsom salt foot gel and I said I can use this or I can give this to my sister she works in a hospital she's the she cleans the rooms and her feet always hurt her so maybe this will be in her birthday pack don't don't watch that part Vicky here's another one of these oh and then I see everybody with these panko breadcrumbs and I said I got to try these panko breadcrumbs I've never tried them but I see everybody hauling them and everybody says it's a good buy so I'm gonna Put, add this to my pantry and use it one day. Oh, here's another rollers for that lady. Then my mother needed some oatmeal lotion because she has very dry skin. And she wants oh, lotion, no, soap. Oatmeal soap. So I found her some more oatmeal soap for her dry skin. Oh, and here's some more little, it's a little table and chairs for my fairy garden in my backyard. One day maybe I'll record my fairy garden and show you guys. It's so cute. Oh, everybody's hauling this hard candy, hard candy makeup. And I found this, the, the fairy dust. I don't know what you do with it, but it says it's a highlighter. Highlight your face, highlight your essentially girl stuff. I don't know. But anyways, <laughs> I had to buy it because I saw everybody hauling it. And I said, let me just buy myself one just to have, because makeup lasts me forever. I have makeup for years. So this is probably gonna last me until I'm 50. And here's another one of these. Oh, another one of these, the poppy things. I really should organize this first, huh? Here's some crackers my mother wanted. Um, I don't like these things myself. Cheese and peanut butter crackers. I don't, I don't like them, but my mother does. And probably her senior friends in the senior building like them too. I don't know, but she thought it was a good deal to get one, two, three, four, six packs for a dollar. She wanted them, so I got them for her. I saw somebody put these sun-dried tomatoes making chicken with a creamy sauce, and it looked good. So I'm going to try to make a chicken with a creamy sauce with these sun-dried tomatoes. Looks good. Oh boy, we got a lot of stuff, guys. Still got more stuff here. I thought these were so adorable. I don't have a party coming up. I don't have anything planned anytime soon. I don't think anybody does. But... Hopefully the world gets back to normal soon. And if I have like little appetizers and a backyard barbecue with friends over, I can make it fancy. The little toothpicks and they have like little balls on them. They were just fancy. Just to have fancy little balls. <laughs> oh, and then I saw somebody hauling this loofah soap. Oh, you can really see it in my, you can really see it. It looks like a little face. Hello. Hello, I'm a loofah soap. But yeah. Um, and I never had anything like this. Oh, he goes, oh, that smells very coconutty. Very, oh, makes me want to go sit on a beach. Anyways, I've always wanted to try this and I, I've seen people haul it and I'm like, I'm going to buy myself one when I see it and I saw it. So I got it. And in the crafter's corner, I found these little pop dot tapes 
I think these are be work help me a lot in my little crafts. I do little crafts here and there and just something to put in my craft stuff. Okay, we're getting close to the end. Salt natural. My mother wanted some salt. She said, get me a box of salt. Box, I don't know. I couldn't find a little circly box of salt with the little girl with the rain and the so I found this one. Hopefully she won't yell at me because she's yeah, my mother. Oh, these are the pencils to go with the the book I showed you in the beginning. The color book that you really tiny. Then I see everybody always always hauling this too. This barista blend almond milk. And me and my daughter actually tried almond milk not that long ago. We really kind of liked it. So just to have in the in the pantry, just in case I don't get to the store, because we try not to go to the store very often. We go maybe once every two weeks, once every three weeks. This is our store haul today. Um, just to have in the pantry if we run out of milk and we need some. I only got one because I don't know how this flavor tastes. I don't know if it's supposed to be used with coffee. So there you go. Luna. Then, oh, here's my other stickers. These are little jars. Oh, I thought they were so cute too. They're just so cute. Little jars. Look at look at them. They're see-through. They're they're just so adorable. And they say something on them, but I cannot read that for the life of me. It says some little something. One of them says love, but the other ones I don't know what it says. Okay. Oh. Then I got oh, spa like masks. I got three of these. Oh, I also got a cat in my bag again. Oh, my daughter saw this mango nectar and she said mom the lady we got seven of these it must be good so we wanted to try it so we got one of these some lady at the store was buying seven so we got that then i guess the old people in the place want some soft caramel this is for my mother and her friends at the senior home my mother and her friends at the senior home my mother and her friends at the senior home uh cat in the bag Oh, here's the other pomegranate. The cat's literally in the bag. Oh, some more pork and beans. And then I think I only have one more thing left, guys. Not the cat. My sister's been wanting these so bad. So she told me if I went to the, to the dollar tree and I found them to get them for her. But she wanted me to change out the tops. She wanted me to change out the tops, so I got her this. Uh, she wanted them in clear, but she wanted three different tops. And the clear one came with one certain top. So I had to sit there and take the tops off. I know this is inside in the world to do that, but well, things you do for your sister. So I got her the three different kinds, the three different tops on the clear bottles. There you go. The star, the shell, and the other shell. There you go. And about one other little thing just to have in my um, birthday presents. If a birthday pops up and I need something to give somebody, I have a little stash and I need some of these things, you know, once in a while you put them in a the thing, you decorate them for candy, whatever. Anyways, this is always good to have in your birthday stash. There you go, guys. This was my Dollar Tree haul. Oh, here's my other candy. This was my Dollar Tree haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I got tons of stuff now to put away. And, yeah. So... I don't know what you're looking for. All right, guys. Luna says hi. And hope you guys enjoyed it. Until next time, um, stay well, stay safe, and hopefully I'll get used to this Dollar Tree stuff and try again. All right. Talk to you later. Bye.